By default, VS Code doesn't have the autosave option turned on. However, it's very easy to turn on autosave. Go to File and select the autosave option. And as I type in, the file is being autosaved. As you can see, I don't have a dirty bullet here. But if you want to have more control over autosave, VS Code provides additional settings. Press down Control, Comma, or go to File, Preferences and Settings, and type in autosave. And here we have three noticeable options, after delay, on focus change, and on windows change. Let's go over each one and see how it works. Let's go first with after delay. After delay basically saves your file after a short period of time. By default, it's set to 1000 milliseconds, which is one second. But let's set it to be four seconds and see how it works. And as you can see, it will save the file in four seconds. Exactly. Now let's see how on focus change works. On focus change saves your file when the editor loses focus, like clicking away on another file. Now I'm switching over to the settings file and as you can see the dirty bullet here uh, is no longer here, which means the file has been saved. Now let's see the on window change option. This option saves your file when you tab away from VS Code, like selecting another application from the background. Let's test it out. Alright, and now I'm switching over to the Brave browser and let's see if the file has been saved. Yeah, exactly. And the, our file has been saved. And that's all. I was Carol and I'll see you in the next one.